okay guys so this is the all new techno common 17 pro yes a good successor to the techno common 16 pro so this is my unboxing and initial impression of this device So when you open the box, yes, you have the device first and the key features are labeled out. Next you have the 12 plus 1 month warranty card, a transparent rubber case for the device. Next you have a small envelope and it houses the SIM ejector tool. Next you have a USB-C cable with an orange accent, the earphone and then the charging brick that supports fast charge. So let's go ahead and see what the Technocamon 17 Pro looks like. Wow, this is beautiful. A pure masterclass design is what the Techno Carbon 17 proposes. This is really a huge step up and I must say, it is one of the best innovations the brand has introduced. You have a 3.5D body that is really smooth to touch. And this color, Ice Silver offers a crystal clear feel to the device. And when you hold the device upright, you have the camera bomb that goes all the way out. And you also have an extra microphone on top. And behind is a super 64 megapixel ultra quad camera lens in a rectangular design with a quad LED flashlight. And then you have the highlighted techno branding. On the right, you have the fingerprint that is also the power button and the volume rocker. And below, you have a speaker grill, the USB C port, a microphone, and the 3.5 earphone port. On the left, you have a slot that takes two nano SIMs and a micro SD card. If you have seen the Redmi Note 10 Pro, this phone's camera bomb protrudes the same way. So with the included rubber case, it fits properly and also protects the camera bomb of the Camon 17 Pro. On the front, you have a 6.8 inches dot in display. It is an IPS LCD panel that poses a full HD plus display and it refreshes at 90 Hz and has 82% screen to body ratio. The viewing angle is really impressive with a 395 pixels per inch density. You can view up to 1080p for YouTube videos and has a resolution of 1080 by 2460 pixels. The display has 500 nits of brightness. On the software side of the Techno Camon 17 Pro, it runs Android version 11 out of the box and the performance is backed up by 8 gigs of RAM and a 256 gigs of internal storage. You have MediaTek Helio G95 system on chip with Mali G76 MC4 GPU for graphics, making the Techno Common 17 Pro a very good gaming device. You also have a power 5000 mAh battery that supports fast charging with a 25 watt charging brick. The side mounted fingerprint is also very convenient and it is fast enough to unlock the device in seconds. Yes, Techno outdid themselves yet again on this one. But the main feature of the Techno Camon 17 Pro is the camera performance. And being a camera centric device, this phone camera is very impressive. It is not a hype or a market gimmick. This is beautiful and well defined. You have clarity and real colors in its images. You also have other camera modes to give you a good photography experience. You can shoot up to 4K videos at 60 and 30 frames per second and also 1080p at 30 and 60 frames or 720p and you have a good image stabilization system. Hey guys, so it doesn't get any better than this. I'm talking the 48 megapixel front facing camera of the Techno Camon 17P. I am currently shooting at 1080p 60 frames. You can also shoot at 4K 1080p 30 frames and also 720 at 30 frames per second. So what do you think of the picture quality and the sound coming out from this device? For me, I am so much and totally in love with the picture quality. Let me know what you think in the comments below. On the front, nothing beats the 48 megapixel lens of the Camon 17 Pro. It is so decent. So guys, you can get this device at 125k or $340. And that's budget friendly enough and fair to spare for this device. 
So guys, this is the Technocam on 17 Pro, a very good value for money device. Thank you so much guys for watching. I will see you in my full review video next. Peace.